This was the day that Cambodia's opposition leader hoped he would walk free. But for the second time, courts rejected Kem Sokar's appeal against his ongoing detention on treason charges. And again, the leader of the Cambodia National Rescue Party was denied the chance to be in court to argue his case. A few opposition supporters and members showed up, only to witness another setback for their party that's now being threatened with dissolution. Our existence was based on the people's support. Uh, if uh, the government wants to dissolve our party, you have to answer to the, the people. Kem Sokar led his party in local elections in June, and it made big inroads into the dominance of the ruling Cambodian People's Party. But on September the 3rd, he was arrested and charged with treason for a speech he gave four years ago. In it, he talked about winning power with help from the United States. Since his detention, around half of the opposition members of parliament have left Cambodia, fearing arrest. They say the government is scared of losing the general election in July next year, so is trying to wipe the opposition out. The CNRP wants targeted sanctions introduced against some members of Cambodia's government, a move that's been backed by several United States senators. But there's a sense that Prime Minister Hun Sen feels emboldened by the significant financial support this country receives from China. But China is also interested in stability. And if that's under threat, it may start to question the actions of the Cambodian government. But there's no sign that the government will back down despite international condemnation. Rights groups want Kem Sokar released immediately. We want more clarity, both in terms of safety, his whereabouts, but more importantly, we want to ensure these trumped-up charges are dropped. Uh, we are also concerned that there will be more victims on the way as the election uh, date draws nearer. Without a credible opposition, the election may be largely meaningless and would almost certainly see Hun Sen extend his rule. On the 16th of November, the court will begin to decide if it'll grant the government's wish and dissolve the Cambodia National Rescue Party. Wayne Hay, Al Jazeera, Phnom Penh.